Alrighty. So now we're, uh... There we go. That's what I was hoping for. <laughs> I want these creepers to blow up the TNT here. Because, uh, that'll help me a lot. Um... Okay, what was I talking about? Uh, these stupid... There's things spawning in here. Oh, it's creepers. Oh, good. Here we go. That helps out a little bit. Um, <coughs> my main problem here is that these spawners are everywhere. And he's very kindly provided TNT everywhere to stop the... or to help take out the spawners and whatever, but I don't have anything to actually... Oh my god. I don't like this. I don't like this at all. What's in here? Food. That I can't carry. Let's put that away. No, I want that. Those away. Those away. I don't need this many arrows. But I appreciate the gesture. Um, put that up there. Um... Take this down. Oh, right, there was more food in there, wasn't there? Yeah. Uh, I actually don't want that food. Because my soup works pretty well. And I don't have to... Yeah, there's stuff up there. And it's going to drop on me if I try to go forward here. So instead, I'm going to... I'm going to try going up. And... I'll take this TNT with me. What, oh, was there supposed to be like a bridge here before or something? And it's just gone now? <laughs> I don't know what this is about. Oh, but see those gas spawners. Oh, dear God. I was holding down shift and I managed to fall a block there. If I had fallen all the way down there, I'd be screwed. Okay, this wall is just as patchy as those walls are. Oh, oh. Because I'm awesome, that's why. Okay. Okay, make sure there's no zombies above my head. Because I can hear them. I just can't see them. What? Where? Oh my god. That was pretty scary. Oh my god. Nope. There we go. I should have shot it over there. Actually, I should have shot it over there. Can you destroy gas spawners with gas fireballs? Can you destroy spawners with fireballs? Doesn't matter if they're gas. I don't know. Okay, so that went smoothly. Um, I'm just going to, you know, come over here and pour that down a little bit so that hopefully it'll hit the bottom and turn a bunch of that into obsidian so I don't have to worry about falling into lava oh then again I may have just created a very large spawning ground for many enemies to spawn on so that might not have been the best idea kids don't do that at home it's probably not safe okay where are these zombies there's one up there after that creeper incident back there, I'm going to kill... Oh, oh dear god. That scared the crap out of me. Stupid gas in their hitboxes. Okay. Because uh, the, like, the part that you actually hit is their tentacles. The rest doesn't really count. <laughs> like, if you hit them elsewhere, they just don't take damage, so... Would you look at you standing over there on the edge? Come on. Spawn. Mm. 
Okay, so we have spawners up there. And okay, gas spawner down. Now I just have a creeper to deal with. Don't hiss at me, and don't shoot at me. Wow, that was a weird... I didn't mean to place that block, but it works. I suppose I don't need to be shifting right now because I'm up against the wall, but... Still. Okay, I'm going to try going in this way. Hi there, creeper. Um, actually, I'm going to try going up first. Starting over here. <laughs> because um, it's always better to approach from the top. What was that? Where it's much less dangerous. And now I'm out of stone, so I will have to use my wooden planks. Oh, cool. Maybe I can just get them all to walk off the edge like that. That would be convenient. Fuck off. There you go. Got one to fall off. I think that one's actually on the opposite wall. That one skeleton that I killed over there. And he's dead. Continue making my way across. Okay, it's pretty dark up here. <laughs> I see you down there. Looking at me with those beady eyes. Beady, non-existent eyes. Wow, that skeleton spawned just as the other one died. Oh, wow. He also died in one hit. I mean, two hits, instead of three. If a skeleton spawns up top, I should be fine. If a skeleton spawns below, like he just did, I should also be fine. <laughs> I should still be fine, I should say. Okay, he just killed himself. That makes things pretty simple for me. Okay, now. I can't get in there. Well, I can get in there just by dropping down, but I don't want to. Um, honestly, I feel like the easiest way for me to get there would be to just go down and then walk across and then climb up. But I'm going to be stupid and do it this way. And again, just pour down some water. Make sure that uh, the area underneath is adequately drenched. <laughs> and hop up here. Red wool. Red wool is supposed to be the hardest. I mean, I'm not going to say it was easy, but it wasn't that hard. Especially this room, which I would think should be, like, super hard. But it wasn't. Um, how am I going to do this? I don't know. I want to go up there and see if there's anything up there for me. Because I figure there should be, right? I mean, I don't know. I think I could drop and land on that. Without dying, <laughs> specifically. Got an angry skeleton up there now. Get down from there. Okay, if I back up and kill these guys... And they shouldn't be spawning anymore because I'm far enough away. And, uh... Yeah. So I... Hey there! What are you doing? Get out of here. Oh! Hold on. No, I have no more cobblestone. Hmm. There we go. I forgot that I can make levers to set off TNT with. And I am going to actually... There we go. Do this. 
Make some scaffolding? No! Oh boy, that was rough. That was a rough death right there. This is going to be rough. Um, I have to pause the recording. Oops, sorry, I just dragged it over the screen there. So uh, I'll be back in just a second. Alright, so I figured you guys wouldn't want to see me um, running all the way back or getting stuff to uh, that I would use to run all the way back. So um, I just cut that part out. Um, and, oh, fudge muffins. Um, so I will be... Crap. How am I supposed to get up there now? Oh, there we go. That wasn't too bad. Uh, that, that shouldn't have killed me. I should have been able to get back into that water stream. But for some reason, the stupid thing just didn't want to let me. So I'll take it as a good sign that those blocks are still there. <laughs> um, at least I know that the, uh, the timer didn't destroy all my stuff. Okay, you need to get back, buddy. There you go. Now I'll just go grab my other stuff. Fortunately, it looks like everything survived. Like, I'm assuming that's the battle sign right there. Those are my bows. There's my chest plate. Okay. And hop on over here to grab the rest of my stuff. Okay, diamond helmet. Yep. Diamond boots. Yep. Uh, diamond pickaxe goes there. I have an extra bow now that I don't need. Um, there we go. I did grab a bed for really no reason. <laughs> um, I don't really know why. Okay, that looks like it's all my stuff. I don't want that. I, okay. If I want to get rid of this stuff, I'm going to have to put it elsewhere. Oh, cool. And the, 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 the wool even survived, so... Yeah, none of my stuff went into lava. Thank God I put that water there beforehand. Or I probably would have... Oh, boy, you little bugger. Uh, I hate you. He just hit himself with his own arrow. Don't shoot at me. Don't shoot at me. You know you don't you know you don't want to. Oh whoa, 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 leggy leg. Okay, hold on just a second. I need to other video popped up again. Um and no, I hate you. Stop it. No. Jeez, okay, that's not gonna work. i hey, you? You know what? I'm I could go without your sass. I'm missing a pair of diamond pants here on the, on the ground. And the skeleton has awful aim. Where'd my... There it is. Oh, he's dead now. Okay. This is annoying. <laughs> um, I probably should have organized my inventory before I came all the way back up here. Like this. Okay. Okay. So I've got this. I've got two of that. I'm just going to grab these here, because now that there's no threat of gas blowing up my stuff, um, these blocks help me out quite a bit. Um, there's no blocks in there, but I will take these now that I've got uh, bread in my inventory already. Stick those in there. Actually, you know what? Just for building blocks. I'm not going to be using them for anything other than that, so it's not like I'll be cheating or anything. It's just that I need them for building blocks. Um, so I'll put those down there. Uh, actually, I'll use the lapis first because there's more of them. Put those up there. I've got some torches, not a whole lot. Put that back. Um, you know, I, I don't need to mine anything right now. Okay, so what I need to do is I need to make this wider. A lot wider. <laughs> all the way up to the edge here so that when I go up there I won't get shot off by that stupid skeleton that's bugging me and I need to set a back to this so that once I get up here he can hit me without knocking me off and of course now he's not going to and oh dear okay something's fighting back there I will grab these. Oh dear. Okay. 
Yep, that works. Nope. So close. I just need to flip that lever. And boom goes the dynamite. There we go. Get down a little bit. Okay. That should take care of those guys. Nope. Not quite. Nope. Huh. See? That's why you build the backing to it. Okay, we're good. Okay. Yep, time to back up. And uh, try this again. Okay, so now we've got uh, a bunch of them are dead. Now I might be comfortable jumping down there from up top, which I really feel like is the best option, just because um, I can get in easily. The only problem is that if they catch me and start shooting me, which actually this I can use gravel for, I just want to set up a back up here. You know? Uh, do I have another water bucket? I do. So I'm going to do this. And hopefully that will protect me or not. I hate my life. <laughs> that was close. Okay. This is ridiculous. I need to get another block up there. Is there anything up there even? I don't know. I really, like, I'm starting to doubt that there is at all anything up there. Okay, buddy. You need to just get over, get over yourself. Okay. These guys need to die. Oops. <laughs> that was retarded. Um, okay, how many are there? Why are some of them taking so many hits to kill? That definitely didn't hit it. That may have. I have no idea. I just need to get that block there. Okay. That helps a very significant amount. Because that means that I can come over here and build that there. And I guess that there. And now I have a back wall. That can protect me. Okay. Oh, up a little higher. Okay. So now even if I get shot, I won't get shot off. You know? They're still shooting over there. They're not some happy... They're not very happy guys over there. Ow, my legs! <laughs> guys, be happier. I command you to be happier. I need you to just die in a hole. Or in a pit of lava. Okay, okay. Two of them just jumped off the edge. I'll take that as a good sign. And, uh, try to get up here. No, stop shooting at me. Oh my god. No, you die. Okay. This is how it has to be. <laughs> okay, whatever is in there should be dead now. <laughs> Theoretically, it's spawners. Probably, it's absolutely nothing. <laughs> Why is it shaped like a swastika? Ah! Okay, so the spawner is in the thing. Gotcha. And yep, there's nothing up here. Nothing for me, at least. Except pain and suffering! Get out of here! Get me out of here, this is a whole total waste here. But that's okay. It was fun. So yeah, I guess there's nothing up there. Other than just stuff to make us want to kill ourselves. Anyway. Um, yep, so that's this dungeon down and skeleton <laughs> I still don't like skeletons nothing has changed nothing has changed particularly the skeletons exactly as I remember them okie dokie now let's see this leaves us we just finished um, Dungeon something or other. I don't know. <laughs> um, 
No, I don't want to put that away. I don't put, want to put that away. I want to put that up here. I don't know what I'm talking about. I don't want that. I, no, that's not what I wanted. I wanted this. And I don't want bread. I hate bread. I like mushroom stew. It works just fine. Don't want those. I don't need more arrows. I have plenty. Just from using looting stuff to kill things. Or whatever it was that I used to kill things. Okay, so this is dungeon 15 down. And, uh, that means there's one more. And that would be in the nether. And I can't remember, I honestly can't remember if this is the end of the episode or part 2, or part 1 even. So, uh, I have to pause the video. I think I'll see you in a second. I could be wrong, but, uh, I guess we'll find out. Okay, guys, I promise you, I will get fraps soon. Um, this map is almost over, so I probably won't do it before this map is over. But, uh, I, I promise you that once this map is over, I will not record another Vex map until, um, I have... What's up there? Ah, get back. There's something up there. I will not record another Vex map or adventure map or anything like this. Anything particularly spectacular with long episodes until, um... I get something that can record soft that some better recording software, and hopefully it won't take too long. Cause get back, nope. Oh, phew. I hate grabbers. Okay, um, let's just come on up here. And I came out of that with a little TNT too. So, I mean, I don't really use TNT that often, but uh, can't hurt, can it? Well, I suppose it can. That's like the definition of TNT, but. Anyway, is there something up here? This is what I was looking at. I saw the little lines up here, and, oop, and I just assumed that meant there was something here, but I guess not. Which, ow, that was a little more painful than I was expecting it to be. I don't know why. I guess I just figured I was invulnerable. Because, <laughs> I mean, since when am I not invulnerable? Ow. Okay, that lava just looks so suspicious to me. Is there supposed to be, like, a symbol in that? I don't... Tons of coal. Stop it! I hate you. Get back here. Stupid skeletons. Okay, I gotta be careful, because there's lava around here in that hole. And the way he does his little lava holes, there's, like, no way you can get out, because they're way too deep. I mean, you could always try to build out underneath yourself, but, um... You know, it it minimizes the chance of that succeeding. Well, I suppose I shouldn't say it minimizes it, but it, it hurts it a lot. Um, that's a big vein of coal right there. What, did they? Did he think that I'd already be through all this coal? I haven't lost, like, any coal throughout this entire map. I guess I'm just too cool for that. Oh, oh dear. Sword is gone. <laughs> Diamond sword is dead. The Wicked Witch is dead. Oh god. Except that would be more like God is dead because uh <laughs> that that was like my saving grace right there. <laughs> I uh I don't know how much of a chance I stand without my uh my diamond sword. That's going to hurt. Well then again, I only have one more dungeon left and that's the one in the Nether where I don't intend to be doing a lot of sword fighting. So, I suppose it lasted me exactly as long as it needed to. Or exactly as long as I needed it to. Whoa! Oh my god, I almost fell straight in the lava right there. <laughs> oh, sorry for hitting the mic. I'm scratching my nose. Well, my lip. Whatever. But, uh, yeah, I mean, it, I guess it wouldn't be that hard for me to go back into these dungeons and get the stuff. Because, like, that whole pathway there was pretty clear when I ran back the first time. And, uh, yeah. So, it's not like it's that hard to get to either of those dungeons. And then once I'm in, I've already finished, like, the whole thing, so it's not like it'd be really difficult to, uh, get my way back through, you know? So. But anyway. This is actually a relatively small map, isn't it? Because, like, all we've got is the two islands. And, uh, that's pretty much it. So, I mean, there are a few big caves, but green wool and red wool. Now I just need gold block, which I'll get in the nether, and black wool, which I'll get in the nether. So we're almost there, guys. And crap, I think this is part two of this episode. 
Oh boy. <laughs> Why can't I remember that ever? That's really frustrating. Like, you guys may think it's frustrating because you're just like, REMEMBER! But I mean, I have, to, I have to sit here and I'm like, I can't remember, guys. I can't remember. I'm sorry. Don't hate me. <sighs> it's rough. Uh, first world problems. Okay, uh, first world problems. I can't speak. Which is probably another first world problem. Is it just the phrase? Is it hard to say? Or am I just stupid and can't say it? Let's make some more stew. Alright, so actually, I want to go this way now. Whee! Oh, I just realized that um, if I take that cart this way, then I go this way. And if I take the cart that actually, that this track was originally connected to, I end up going over to the, the place that we just went to and got the wool from. But uh, yeah, so we have one, one dungeon left. And theoretically, I'll be getting a bunch of netherrack from digging up. Uh, to get on top there, so I shouldn't have much of a problem with not having enough blocks. I will have a problem with not having my gold fall damage boots, though. That will cause problems. Oh, but I have buckets, and I can just grab some water and use those to jump down. And that might even help keep things from spawning, too, so I guess that works. I'm going to replace my shovel with the sign, because, I mean, I'm not going to need the shovel in the nether. I mean, sure, you can mine soul sand faster, but or dig up soul sand faster, but it's not that important to me since I don't think there's actually any soul sand in this nether. Oh god, the rain is making so many noises on all this fire. Oh, oh, we went under the pig head. I was like, new biome? Or desert biome? But nope, it's just the what? Oh, I walked in fire. Probably shouldn't do that, huh? Okay. So... We can do this. I just need to not go from the bottom again. Oh, right, not netherrack. Snow. Yay. Hi, Pigman. I'm gonna grab some of these, because, whoa, that thing just popped out of nowhere. Die. Um, because I need something to build with to get up. I'll have crap tons of snowballs, that's for sure. This is gonna look so weird. Hold on, I need to get my buckets out. Okay, don't walk in front of me, buddy. <laughs> Yay! Or what's up there? I always wanted to know what, um, like, was up at the tops of this thing. Get away from me. What was up at the top of those things? Like, if they ever, if they actually came from a lava lake, or if they just poured from the ceiling. Which, I'm assuming they just poured from the ceiling. But, um, you know, I never actually found out. So, I suppose this would be my chance now. Oh well. I can just go make a creative world at some point and just go into there. Okay. So, I've got my water. So, the reason that one's melted is because there's glowstone next to it. So, the, the light is melting it. Because, um... The ice melts whenever there's glowstone or a torch within, li or, or fire probably, within a couple blocks of it. So, gassed. Don't know where though. Probably somewhere in inconvenient. Oh wow, yeah, I guess I will need my shovel, won't I? What I won't need is my, <laughs> is my pick. Which mines, thing, mines this snow slower than my hand, or as slow as my hand, I should say. Oh, hey, I killed it. <laughs> that was, ooh, more diamond. Alright, so I guess he did leave some uh, large diamond deposits here for us. For us to make use of. I can't believe I forgot that the nether was all icy. It's kind of like a big thing to forget. you know. Oh, hey, I let go there. Oh, there we go, it's dead. What the? Oh, it's on, the snow is on fire. Tell me how that works. More diamond. Alright, I guess I just have to look up to find the diamond. Oh, there's the... the thing. So let's grab my shovel out. And try to get up. Well, I suppose I could try to climb the ice, but... Eh. Wow, yeah, okay, there's tons of diamond here. 
so I don't need to worry about making diamond anything. Um, did I bring some wood with me? Oh, see, this is why I, you always bring wood with you, because you're going to need it to make things like workbenches, because I was just going to be like, oh, I'll just make diamond tools right now, since I can get the diamonds up there. But, uh, nope. Not happening. There's more diamond there. Jeez, and what is up there? Oh, I'm so tempted to go up there. <laughs> But, uh, we've got more important things to do. Okay, to where are we... Or where is our destination at? At. Where is our... Where is... To where... Where are we... In what direction... I... I don't know where I'm going with this. I don't even know what I was trying to say there. Um... Okay. I'm going to have to get... Up higher... Okay, let's try going this way. Nope, still not high enough. Okay, well, first I want to get... Uh, nope, I need to actually get up, because I'm not high enough to continue going forward. Okay, and I need to pause the video now, but again, I can't remember what point at what point in the video we are here. But, uh... You know what, I'll just mix this all into one thing since this is the last dungeon. So uh, I'll be back in just a second. Alright. So I'm just going to come over here. Okay, we're almost there. Oh, what's on top? Oh, spawners. That's what's on top of there. Oh, do I have my TNT on me? Where is it? Where did my TNT go? No! Are you kidding me? This would have made everything so much... E oh, well, that would be a little dangerous, actually. Dropping TNT on a wool chest. <clears throat> on a wool chest. Manly voice. Um, the roof here is, like, ridiculously high. I keep having to go up and up and up and up. Just to let a little, 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 little light in. Okay, now let's see if we can't get down a little bit. Okay. Okay, so we need to go this way a bit more. Okay, that should be good, I think. Oh boy. We're almost there. And we actually overshot it a little bit. Okay, I'm lagging so much right now. Okay, and we overshot it again, so it's like... Oh my god. Okay. Well, I guess we're there. And I guess I'm going to just... First of all, try to throw these things away. And, uh... Do this. Okay, I've gone way too far down. Why haven't I hit the... Oh, it's right there. Really? Skeleton spawners? Alright. Got the black wool! Okie dokie. Now just replace what the snow in my inventory with that. And then I should be able to just climb down directly underneath the... Uh, the chest and get out. 
Except this whole thing is lined with spawners. Oh dear god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Guys, do you hear those gas? Oh my god. I'm afraid to turn around. And I'm lagging so bad I don't know if I can. Oh my god. <laughs> well, here's our gold block. Stop shooting at me. <laughs> so that went pretty well. Oh, no, give me my bow back. I don't want the snow blocks, but... Oh, I keep trying to strafe, that's why. <laughs> Too many MMOs. Okay, gold block. Now let's get back. Okay, I think I know where we are. Just gotta hop on up here. But seriously, there's so many snowballs in the vicinity right now. Uh, from me digging out that whole area, and then so many gas and... Probably ice on fire. I wouldn't be surprised if the snow can catch fire. I don't see why the ice can't. Um, so, yeah, look at that. That all just happened because they were all flying around in the area and then shot down at me when I was standing in the middle. So all their shots just... I just ran and all their shots missed, so it just went around and around and around and around. And just... They pretty much just shotgunned me, except all of the bullets were pointed near me. So, um... Ow, you douchebag. Quit it. Stop lighting stuff on fire. Stop it! I hate you. Okay, we're free. <laughs> now, where's our... There it is. Okie dokie. So... Looks like we've got the last wool. I don't really have anything planned for celebration, unfortunately. Like the same, like same thing with the last map. Um, like I would love to celebrate something, but I mean, I don't know. What should I should I blow up the pig? I mean, I can't really get that much TNT. Oh, wrong direction. But uh, I don't know. See, cause like I don't have the the resources to do a whole lot here. Um, Etho on Legendary made a freaking <laughs> uh, creeper trap, because there was a bunch of, there was one area with a ton of creeper spawners in it, so he just turned it into a drop trap and, oh god, my minecart. Okay, oh, I'm lagging because I've got um, particles on. Alright, there we go. Now, it should be a straight shot home. Well, we have to backtrack a little bit because we go out this way and then come back down, but aside from that, it should be a straight shot home. This does go far out here, doesn't it? Yeah, I think it's weird. The When you decrease the particles, it decreases the amount of particles that hit, that are bouncing off the... Okay, pretend that didn't happen. <laughs> I really need new recording software. Um, so, uh... What was I talking about? I don't know. I have no idea. But, um, anyway, I'd love to celebrate, but yeah, uh, Etho made a, sorry, god, I'm jumping around. Etho made a, a creeper trap in an area with a bunch of creeper spawners, so he can make a bunch of, um, TNT, because in Legendary there's a desert, so you can just take sand from there, um, and make tons of TNT, so he can do whatever he wants with it, but, um, I don't have that luxury. <laughs> I mean, I'm sure I could make a creeper spawn, or, or a creeper trap if I wanted to, um, it's just that. I didn't really need it for this map. Like, I was thinking that I would need it because I was under the assumption that it would be very difficult. Like, extremely difficult, like to the point where I'm crying because it's too difficult. And, whoa, I almost just fell right in the lava. And I would have hated myself forever and ever. Because, uh... Yeah, that would have been awful. And I would have hated myself forever and ever. If that wasn't clear. Because I'd have to go back and get that black wool from the freaking... <sighs> Let's not think about that. What we should think about is that we finished the monument. Yay! <laughs> it's been a long, long uh, adventure here. And, uh, yeah. Here, I'll take this out. And just place it right here. You can't hear it, but uh, <laughs> I can. <laughs> so... 
Hopefully, once I get fraps, I'll be able to do that too. Make it so that you guys can hear what I'm doing, what I hear in the game, because I think that would be awesome. Um, I don't know. Maybe there's another program that I just don't know exists that uh, I need to get in order to do something like that. But uh, either way, this actually is a nice fitting theme to the end of the uh, video here. I like it. So it's it's been fun, guys. I, I really enjoyed this map. Um, I never thought I'd come back to it after that first time, because like I said, I got the first two, or I got almost the second wall, and then rage quit. Because um, that that was the dungeon with the big spider spawner tower thing, and um, in the cave, I don't know if you guys remember it. I think that's where we found our first enchanted armor, too. Um, but uh, yeah, that was that was a pretty rough dungeon for me for some reason. Maybe it's just because I didn't know how to play back then. It was a long time ago. But uh, yeah, so I never thought I'd come back to this map, let alone finish it. But I always did avoid watching videos of it, just in case, you know? And I'm glad I did. Um, because uh, now we've done it. I like how all the colors on this side of the monument are all nice and happy. Then over here it's like brr, poop, green, blood, darkness. <laughs> like... I don't know why I always feel like blue and or brown and green go well together. I mean, not well together. They just go together. <laughs> Cause like I picked, I see this brown and I go poop, and then I see the green and I'm like sewage poop, <laughs> rotting poop. I don't know, moldy poop, something like that. And uh, then got the color of blood, color of death and darkness. And uh, yeah, but over here it's like white happy, orange happy, purple happy. Light blue, happy. Yellow, happy. Green, happy. Pink, happy. Gray, eh. Light gray, slightly less eh. Cyan, yay. Purple, yay. Or darker purple, yay. Um. Yeah, those are different colors. All right, just making sure. And then it's like blue, eh. I mean, it's kind of dark, but oh well. And then it's like poop and sewage poop, blood and darkness, and then metal, which is weird. I almost feel like it's a periodic table because all the things are just like non-metals and then metals. You'd only get that if you actually knew what the periodic table a Anyway, I have to go. So uh, thanks for watching, guys, and this has been awesome, and I really look forward to doing another map. Um, I'll put an update video about what exactly I'm going to be doing for the next map and stuff. So yeah, look forward to that. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching. Bye.